There's got to be a way out of this. Johnny. I'm dying. There's nothing can stop that. V. My name is Songbird. I'm an NUS intelligence analyst. I know about the bomb ticking in your head. And I can save your life. With Cyberpunk 2077's Phantom Liberty DLC basically around the corner, with this DLC set to release on the 26th of September next month, we got a brand new gameplay trailer to check out and break down, talk about many new features many ain't aware of and more. Let's go. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. So you guys who ever watched my cyberpunk videos, I was one of a rare few content creators who loved this game from day one. I saw past the buggy release and knew eventually it was going to be one of the best games I'd ever played. It was before they fixed the problems that people had with it. It's now if you jump in guys and play today, an incredible experience you will not regret playing. But it's about to get much much better. CD Projekt Red dropped a brand new gameplay trailer today called New Ways to Play. If you haven't seen it yet, check it out right here, right now. Okay, yeah, let's go. V, my favorite Merc. Welcome to Dogtown. There's a job. Coordinates provided. You know what to do. Get your ammo, assault rifles, tactical gear. And thinking of buying some iron. The logical choice. Damn. Green view. Home stretch. Getting a ripper to overclock your chrome before the fight. Not a bad idea. Okay, I'm ready. Get this show on the road. Job done. Premium work, V. I'm closing the gig and sending you a little bonus. Something that will spirit you home safely. Someone dispatched a hunter. Good luck. Oh, fuck incoming! Fire till she drops! Got a net runner cinch here! Need backup yeah. right now! This won't mark the end of our collaboration. You will hear from me soon. This, I guarantee you. How badass does that look, people? Wow. I mean, so much has changed from the early days, and so much is coming with Phantom Liberty. So at the end of the trailer, it lists what's new. So let's go from here, guys. A dangerous new district so yes people phantom liberty introduces a densely packed new location called dog town looking pretty epic indeed 
It also introduces dozens of new story quests and gigs with brand new rewards which we'll come to see. It also adds something we have wanted to see for a long long time in that vehicle combat. We do see some of this within the trailer and what we do see looks really exciting with us being able to hack other vehicles on the fly. You also get guys a completely new revamped police system where guys there are actually police chases, roadblocks and much much more. This is one of the things I actually truly thought was missing initially upon this game's release. I thought it would come much sooner but I'm glad it is coming with a completely new revamped policing system which is going to be absolutely amazing along with a combat AI overhaul which I cannot wait to experience. We also get endless dynamic events and missions which also sound super 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 cool. But moving on, redesigned cyberware and perks. This is definitely a game changing thing, and I feel uh, well, the way we played Cyberpunk will drastically change for the better, with those build options scaling massively, which is nothing but good for sure. The redesigned and new perks also look completely incredible and will change up the way we play this game for sure. We see some in action with the Blade Runner finisher. We also see the bullet deflect which looks really cool. The opportunist which looks absolutely brutal. In fact I'm certain if I show this on YouTube they will penalise me. So sorry guys. Just imagine a handheld Gears of War chainsaw gun. We then see the air dash which looks like something straight out of the matrix, gotta love it. We see a new finisher called the salvage sling where you basically lob enemies at other enemies, who doesn't want to do that? Another one called pulley and then we see dead eye, cool as F. We also see brand new relic skill tree where we do see a quick glimpse of this within this trailer where they showcase the launch capacity of the ride the spatial mapping and limiter removal which all look amazing and fun to use. We know of a new level cap too, this will no doubt take into account the many many new things we will have to spec into with the changes to the skill trees, this that and the other. And also guys, the loot. Over 100 plus new items which include new weapons, cyberware, fashion and much much more and also guys, new cars. Who doesn't want to see and drive new cars across that beautiful night city? This is what we all want to see. So yeah guys, this DLC is really going to be something and those of you who like me loved and played Cyberpunk from day one, this may just bring us all back together and I cannot wait. Now what I do have planned and I'm actually making at the minute is basically everything you need to know about Phantom Liberty. I completely understand many many people like myself played the game for the first few months and thought you know what I'm just going to pull it down, I'm going to shelf it until DLC comes. A lot's changed, a lot's coming. We know quite a few uh, in regards to information on this DLC, on the Phantom Liberty DLC. So yes, I'm going to pile it all into one video and bring you that video pretty soon. So stay tuned for that. But yes guys, this new this new trailer looked absolutely incredible and I cannot wait. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys, I will see you on that next one.